What's up, Android fans? Tekken Me is back, and this time we have another app roundup just for you guys. So let's get to it. All right. First off, I'm running Nova Launcher Ultimate Custom Clock Widget. I have the Battery Percentage right there, and I have Eye in the Sky Widget right there, and then I have DC Icon. Swipe down, I get to my notification drawer. Swipe up, and I get to my app drawer. First app of today is Sidebar Light. Check it out. Just swipe and you get this Ubuntu style app drawer like glove box, which I reviewed previously in my video. Link right up there. Alright, so you have these shortcuts. You even have shortcuts to like recent apps. Check it out. Nice little animation right there and recent apps pop up. Right? Alright, next up we have First Picture Calendar. First Picture Calendar is basically a widget. Check it out. It's a calendar widget and you can have your custom image right over there. You have your calendar right there and you can even press the next button and go to your next month. A nice little calendar and you can even resize it to however you want it. Big, small, whatever. Even vertical. See that? So that's first picture calendar. Next up we have Craigslist. Craigs this is not just your ordinary Craigslist. This is Mokuria Craigslist. Alright, it's a really nice presentation. You pick a category, you can go to whatever you want. Let's go to computers. And boom. See that? Nice little, really neat cart style. It pops up. Alright, you can change your location right up there. You can even uh, search manually for whatever item you want. If you would like an item, you just click on it and boom. You can email or you can even favorite it for viewing later. Alright, so that's Craigslist. Alright, next up we have Photo Grid Frame Widget. Let's go on the side and there you have it, Photo Frame Widget, right? I have my wallpaper set as folder through which it can access the picture. You can set it manually to whatever you want. Alright, you can flick it up and down to check out all your pictures. If you like a picture, you can even click it and boom, right? You can click the next picture just by, just by going on the side button. Click that back button and you go back. Alright, it's resizable as always. You can make it bigger, you can make it tinier, or you can make it longer. So that's Photo Grid Frame Widget. Next up, we have Unity Launcher. Unity Launcher is basically another Ubuntu style app. Alright, check it out. You just swipe from this side and you get that Unity Launcher, right? You can swipe and you can scroll and you can click on any app. Suppose I want to go to Pocket. I just click on it and go to Pocket. Swipe again, go to Twitter, right? It's just like, uh, what you may call it, Sidebar Light. Sidebar Light has these cool animations though. And you can even add widgets, which is basically power toggles for this, for this Sidebar Light. But you can't do that on Unity Launcher. Next so up, we have My Script Calculator. All right, check it out. So I can basically, it's a handwriting based calculator. So I can write like square root of 48. So I can write 48, right? And I can write square root. Sorry, I have to look through the camera and do it. So there you go, it pops up, right? You can even press the next delete clear button and you can add like two plus 10, all right? I'll detect that. So you can, it's a nice little calculator for handwriting base. Next up, we have Mobile Care Center, all right? Basically, it's just another cash cleaner app with many more functionalities. So you can just scan and it'll clear the cache. You can just click scan and look, the, look at that cool animations. And uh, it even has an app manager where you can uninstall apps just by clicking. So that's an app manager built into this mobile care. All right, it even has a battery saver where it has this option to set up profiles. It has a built-in task killer, but I don't suggest using a task killer because Android does a pretty good job with that. Privacy Advisor will just scan your apps and tell you which apps are sending your contact information and all that stuff, all right? We have Privacy Locker where you can like lock images and all that stuff. So you can set your own password, but it has to be six digit password. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, and click OK. And there you go. You can have, you can lock your pictures, you can lock your videos, or you can even lock files. Click on an album and boom. It even has a cloud backup where it backs up your contact information and you can invite friends. Game Speeder is basically kills the apps and optimizes your phone for gaming. Alright, All right, next up we have Super Widget 
free, all right? So Zooper widget basically has lots of clocks built in with calendar as well as weather and as well as battery percentage and all that goodies. Right there, I like that one right there. Where is that? That one. That's a nice little widget. All right, so you have different styles, different, uh, these are really, really good too. So you can add whatever you want right to your home screen. By the way, it doesn't come in that gray background, it just comes in clear background, all right? So it's a nice little clock widget, simple, easy to use, super widget. And the last app of today is Opera Beta. Opera Beta just came out like yesterday, all right? Let's click on it and check it out. So if you have uh, speed dials, and uh, you can go to Google+, Plus. you can go to YouTube, you can go wherever you want. Just click on it and go straight to that, all right? You can click on the add button, I mean the tab button, all right? So a nice little animation right there. You can go to whichever tab you want. If you want to add a new tab, just click on the new tab and boom, all right? So you can add your speed dial, swipe, and you get your history. You can go revisit your history, swipe here, and you can discover these are basically top stories. You can go to top stories based on category too. So it's basically like a news little newspaper or whatever. Best part about speed dial is you can have your shortcuts or favorites and you can make folders. Check it out. See? I can add my Gmail with my Google Plus and boom, it's in a folder. Opera browser. All right, that's it for now. Today's question is, What's your favorite multitasking app? My favorite would be Swipe Pad, right there. All right, what's your favorite? Let me know down below. If you love this look, be sure to hit that like button and I'll make sure I'll do another video on how to get this look. And thank you all for watching. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like this kind of videos and the future videos, many more to come. All right, take care guys. This is Tech and Me signing out. Peace. Shoo! Check, 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 check